Our company, Bernhardt Furniture, has been in existence for 127 years. Personalization is a very important part of what we do. The customer expects perfect quality in every part of the customer experience, not just product quality, but service quality as well. No two customers we have have exactly the same systems. None of them work with the exact same business processes. So we need to be able to customize our business process to work with these different customers. We market ourselves as a quality product and the, the processes that we have didn't match the image that we were trying to portray for our product. We had a very paper-based solution that created a lot of challenges. It made it hard for us to engage our customers. So this gave us an opportunity to come up with something that was a lot more conducive to our image. We went through a digital transformation that allowed us to move to uh, iOS iPad apps that allowed the sales reps then to more closely engage and interact with the customers. Like a lot of companies, we don't have the internal resources or the skill sets to build out a mobile development infrastructure. Bluemix was a great opportunity for us to be able to go to a platform as a service where we were able to kind of do a proof of concept to see if we could actually take this product to market without a lot of investments. But we were also able to partner with the IBM JSTART team to provide the uh, technical resources to do the development itself. We deployed iBeacons throughout our 100,000 square foot showroom. And with those iBeacons, we were able to capture 2.9 million data points in a single week. Using a Watson Internet of Things API and some machine learning algorithms, we gain critical insights into our buyers and their buying processes. So using the information that we gathered, we were able to optimize our showroom configuration and we were able to increase our sales by 20%. By utilizing a, an API infrastructure, we didn't have to develop a lot of new things. We were able to use these APIs, be able to make calls on those and those services. We could more quickly integrate those into our application to be able to add new features and functionalities to our app. We were able to move to a more microservices architecture to where we could take down individual components and replace those and upgrade different things without impacting the overall application. During this process, we've actually adopted a more DevOps model where it's a more iterative process, it's smaller cycles, quicker feedback, do a little bit of uh, proofing on the product, and that's increased the accuracy of what the business was looking for in their solutions. For me personally, th this whole transformation has been a, a career changer for me. I mean, it's been so exciting. I've, I've been very passionate about the whole entire engagement. I really like to share our story with people because for us to be able to go through this whole digital transformation in a 10-week period was an amazing uh, feat for us. But then the best thing about that is it also laid the groundwork for future changes. I think IT traditionally has been a more reactive function. Uh, and they were basically, you would go to IT when you had a problem that you needed to try to get fixed. Under uh, Lacey's direction, IT is a much more proactive organization and one that is solving problems that their clients didn't even know that they have. 